In today's episode, I want to show off a couple of the new features that are in uh, the new release of, of TechSmith's Snagit, uh, the 2020 edition. Full disclosure, my company, Trust Insights, is a TechSmith affiliate. So if you buy something from us, we receive a small but non-zero uh, commission as part of that purchase. So FTC disclosure, get that out of the way. <clears throat> um Snagit, if you're not familiar, is image capture software. It, takes, it helps you take better screenshots. At least that's what it used to be. Now it's evolving much more to being uh, really a full uh, documentation and tutorial tool. So if you are in marketing and you are doing anything like online courses, online classes, webinars, uh, slide decks for presentations, the what's in the tool that's been added is going to be absolutely invaluable to you for making better, more professional uh teaching materials and for doing it faster so if you've got a course on like i don't know google ads or facebook ads or whatever uh, you're going to find this tool absolutely essential so let's go ahead and <clears throat> flip over here we're going to take a look at uh the interface if you're not familiar is relatively unchanged except for this little new create button and that's what we're going to focus on, focus on today the other stuff all pretty uh typical things so in create there's two new options. One is an image from a template, and one is video from images. So let's uh, let's do let's, uh, a little bit of work here. I'm gonna just uh, do a, a silly series here. Let's take a couple screenshots of my website, and here, and just for a good measure, click on here. So I've got three images in my my tray, my doc here. Let's first go and create image from a template. And you can see you, there's all these different uh, nice little things, uh, preset templates. You can create more, you can download more, uh, things like that. I'm going to do a basic three steps portrait tutorial. Let's go to full size here. And let's go to actual size. How to buy my book. Like really silly, right? You get you get the idea where this is going. Drag and drop one, drag and drop two, drag and drop three. Add your captions, and I've got a very nice, very straightforward uh, template uh, for <clears throat> documenting steps. Super powerful. Again, great if you want to create handouts for uh, talks, things like that. And there, uh, as you can, as you saw in the chooser, there's a bunch of different uh, layouts. And if you are subscribed to their service, you can uh, download uh, free ones and paid ones as well. Let's take a look at just a couple of the selections, frames, comparisons, uh, multi-purpose. You're doing a course, right? You have uh, some certificates. You can drag and drop people's stuff in. You do have to pay for some of these. So just know that there is, if you want the, the free ones, you have to just click on free. You'll find that there's not a whole, there's not a, a ton there, right? That's uh, zero cost, but there are some. The, the basics. So that's the templating part. This one, creating a video from images, I think is going to be uh, a real winner for many of us who are doing uh, this kind of work. Let's select those three images again. Click video from images. And we're going to drag to change the order. There we go. One, two, three. Now what you do here Let's hit record, and this is essentially going to be doing voiceover work. And we'll start at the beginning and say you need to scroll down, and then you find this here, and then you scroll down. All right, very silly, very, very silly. Let's go ahead and hit stop. And what this does is it renders this into a video you can see with the animations right on so that you have essentially a nice little, uh, nice little movie. Now, I did not turn on the voiceover features. You can do voiceover and have full audio to go with this. But <clears throat> even if... Um, even if you didn't do the audio, if you look, you can export just an individual snap or you can export the animated GIF. So if you have a Slack community where you want to be able to explain how to do something, um, animated GIFs render much better 
in in Slack than full size movies. If you're doing PowerPoints and you want to have a presentation with a uh, an animation that is guaranteed to work properly, uh, use the animated GIF feature. So there's these are two of the features that are in the new Snag in 2020 that I think are are super valuable. Uh, I love the video from images because for a lot of people, um, they may not necessarily feel comfortable just doing like turn on the screen recorder like we have in Camtasia here and just and and just go. They may want to have a little more time to think about what it is that they want to show. So by planning out the stages in Snagit and then doing the animations they can feel much more comfortable doing that and then maybe even not even do the voice over here maybe do the voice over in in a different editor later on after they've had some time to think about what they want to say to go with each of the animations but having these uh tools i think makes snagit 2020 really really valuable for a lot of us who are creating educational content are there other ways you can use these tools of course and there's all sorts of you can use all the different uh, features uh that are in the drawing tool for animating your images but these are the ones I think really is a couple of winners for what's new. So if you haven't already upgraded, you should upgrade. Uh, if you want to get this or upgrade, go to trustinsights.ai slash snagit. Again, disclaimer, disclosure, it's an, we're an affiliate. So we do get a small, very small commission um, for, uh, for, your, for your purchase. So if you do make a purchase, thank you. Uh, as always, if you have comments, leave them in the comments box below. Subscribe to the YouTube channel and to the newsletter. And I'll talk to you soon. Want help solving your company's data analytics and digital marketing problems? Visit trustinsights.ai today and let us know how we can help you.